I mean, in front of uh, businesses or uh, residences that you don't even live at is very selfish. Inglewood business owners say they are tired of ongoing pandemic-related protests in their Calgary neighbourhood. Some business owners have organized a counter-protest to send a message for protesters to leave. They have been in Inglewood throughout the pandemic and have now moved to a location in front of Spolumbo's. Tony Spolatini is one of Spolumbo's owners. I do support the, the counter-protest because I think those are just uh, businesses and, and residents of Inglewood just saying, hey, like, just leave us alone. We don't need this. You know, it's pointless. It, it, it's not good. What's it going to change? An individual involved in the counter protest doesn't feel comfortable appearing on camera, saying the protesters are intimidating. But the counter protest movement is business owners who have had enough of the negative impact of the protesters. Sarah Elder Chaminara is an Inglewood business owner. Her store is not located where the protests are taking place, but Elder Chaminara says she is supportive of the counter protesters as what happens in Inglewood impacts her. Time for people with other grievances, um, deep rooted in terms of uh, larger issues that are going on in the world for them to come together and they found community. Um, I think what our job as a community is to say, you know what, this is no longer welcome here. Um, you're welcome to have your views. The counter protest has taken place once already and another is taking place Thursday. Counter protesters want the city to take action. You know, I don't think these people are, are, are bad people, but it's just it's just very it's 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 noise. It's irritating. It can intimidate uh, people coming into the community. It's just it serves it, it serves actually absolutely no purpose. In Calgary, Danina Falkenberg, City News.